Eli. Ingoskati mage langa ngaza sayi kuzate kwe segelana iti katsini tebu ushe na leti matima njengobe imbilo iba melula umabandu bana gelana haba pinze iba segelana. Ingoskati beigate ikuluma ngeskati ya swatini hospice at home ikupa lilanga le hospice and palliative care. Leli langa leli le kuti mbanza ganya ne kupa msibi mwenye ne mtlaba wonke kusege laba mfula bakula kakulu ne kupa nagegela kanyena labo laba ba nagegela gom. Lila nga legu nagegela laba mfula bakula kakulu e World Hospice and Palliative Care li kuchwa njalo nge miyaga e langeni le mtibilo wesbili e nyangeni mpala. I eswati ni hospice at home le si bonza sayo ku inko sikati mage langa ngaza. Aika saleli nga pande kulo kukupale lila nga lil kuchwa mtlaba wonke. Ie swati ni hospice at home, i kumbule lila nga nga pansi kwe stubulule siti, healing hearts and communities. Butlunguge neguzila logube kona nga mova kwa mkutla nga COVID-19 nga ye netimpi, kutengega kutiku nga gegelege pinze futi kubuge etwe. Sibon, sa se eswati ni hospice at home inko sikati mage langa ngaza. Siti sikubolo salo nyaga, siya kumbota futi siya funzi sa kuti. Kupila negula pega mpefumle negumto wa iga kulgati ngoba. Iminde ni lemene nge na labo laba negege la labo laba kulago. Bala segelo tishobo nebangani. Ngeskati sa mkutla nego COVID-19. Our wish is that today's event will activate more passion awareness and participation to care and listen to the members of our community who are going through the heartbroken process, the sick and their caregivers. We are also hopeful that this day will attract more partners and donors to support our mandate. The current crisis is stifling our operations because food and other amenities are key. Yet the global challenges are exerting financial stress on our partners and donors. The theme Healing Hearts and Communities aims to communicate that healing is essential as millions of families and caregivers have lost family members and friends while experiencing social isolation. It is, a ch it is challenging to us to appreciate, it is challenging us to appreciate that even though we might all be devastated, we are, however, trusted to be our brother's keeper. It also challenges us to unite and raise our voices to advocate for palliative care policies and programs that support the needs of patients and their families, which would immensely contribute to their quality of life and mental well-being. Lomelele inlangano yetempi lo yagam samba guleli tote la kansila atio abegate amelelwe ngo tote la Kevin makatange gulomtimbi engulomenia kuvuto guti. Bantu labali nganselwa eti kiti ni letinge mashumi lamane. Bati nga lusito lolo nshobo. Wapinze waveta kuti labenga mashumi la sikombi isa nespotlongo esho mini. Bati la ema veni la satutfuga la faekati le swatini. Each year an estimated 40 million people need palliative care. And 78% of these are in the low and middle income countries like Eswatini. Global demand for care for people with life-threatening illness will continue to grow as, uh, uh, as uh, population age, uh, the burden of non-communicable diseases rises, and new diseases like COVID-19 emerge. Lomunye walabatulo lsito enlanganweni yaka hospice at home mkulu Solomon Kwabe. Upo yaka kulu Ku nagegelega negu sito angule nilangano negu tifuti ipinze imsite gubuya esimeni se gupila. Lentangano se ikutate gu nagegelana negu segelana na semi sebendini ulabo labala segelo eti sobo nebangani. Etinzabeni, pika poli le mazea kumatapam.